All right, boys. It's a little bit late today. 7.20, 19.21 right now. It's not too late, just uh, the evening. It's good weather right now. It's pretty cool. I was going to say cold, but it's not cold, but it's cool. It feels like 60s. You know, down from those uh, 95 degree days, consistently. This feels like a nice breeze. We just decided to come out for a quick ride. this visor and uh, it fogs up a little bit it's fine when I'm moving though and if not I gotta keep it cracked open a tiny bit but then I get all this wind noise so I don't know what the audio is gonna sound like I leave it cracked open just a little bit since it's gonna be late when I'm riding back or dark rather I changed out my windshield for the clear. Not too many vehicles out here at this time. Got to watch out for the animals, mainly, especially at night. There's still plenty of light out for now. When it goes out, it goes out quick though. Hope you guys get in those workouts in daily. Physical fitness is a daily obligation. It doesn't gotta be a lot, it's gotta be something. The days you can't work out, I mean 40 push-ups a day would do it, 50 a day. That's just 10 sets of five throughout the day. I mean that's easy peasy get 10 in, wait an hour, 10, just throughout the day, just do sets of 10. You don't even need to count. Get something in, Have don't have a zero. You guys know you can't be stagnant in life. It's only progression and regression. And if you're not progressing, you're regressing. got to keep moving forward remember that when you get rejected rejection just means redirection just redirect rejections are great you learn from those rejections and you redirect you're gonna be successful to success is paved with paved on the road of failure. So go out there, get lost, and keep failing. Two fellow bikers. Their headlights were so bright I, I couldn't even see if they waved or not. I think they did. having fun out here today. Again, that's a lot of lots of blind spots. You just gotta watch your back, watch your six, watch your front. There's no one really behind me that close, so I can just focus on the front view. Nice and cool. God bless our veterans. God bless the firefighters, the medical staff, the people that were affected by 9-11 directly and indirectly. 
I was in New York when this happened. In Staten Island. I was pretty young at the time. And uh, it was so scary and we could take to see the the two towers, the twin towers from Staten Island. They're, those were unfortunate times. We were afraid, of course. Nothing, none of that, none of it seemed real. And all the lives lost. You're in our thoughts and prayers. And we'll take a moment of silence to all the heroes of 9-11. already done it before so to start off with you could just replicate a process There's a little league baseball game.
Big Pog, this saw a couple of nice spots to hang out at. But it is getting dark quickly. And actually with this Moon MC V2 headlight, it's gonna be the first time I'm really riding at night once it gets a bit darker. So I could see uh, how well this light functions. All right, boys, I'm going to cut this off, try to get some footage of uh, the ride back. This is what the bike looks like at night. Again, I kept the orange for uh, visibility. It catches the eye. Got the triple play in the back, so the turn signals blink uh, when you brake as well. Just what the gauge looks like at night. Let's see if I could get a shot of the brakes. You could set it to different patterns, and uh, that's just what I have it set for now. So uh, yeah, nice and visible. I'll talk to you soon, boys. Peace.